the Outreach Club Pilna Media Council, IITBHU. It's an honor to have you here with us, Professor Sangar Kumar Pal for the Think Talks of Technix IITBHU. Mr. Pal is a computer scientist and president, also former director of Indian Statistical Institute, Kolkata. He is a renowned personality in the field of science and has various papers on fuzzy neutral network, soft computing and machine intelligence. He is the founder president of Indian National Academy of Engineering, Kolkata. Being a recipient of SS Padnagar Prize, he was also awarded Padma Shri in Science and Engineering. Welcome to IIT PhD, sir. Thank you. Shall we begin with the questions? Yes, please. So, how was your experience at Technax? It's excellent. And your campus is excellent. Beachu campus. Uh -huh. So, what influenced you to choose your career in research? I enjoyed uh, studying those subjects, physics, honors. Then after passing M.Tech, that I, I was not liking much electronics. Then I suddenly make a decision of my own that I will do join in a statistical institute. My mentor, Professor Dattamujinda, he gave me one topic like pattern recognition and man-machine communication. It's a new topic, no journal. That's how I, I started uh, my research. So talking about your projects, which was your personal favorite or the one you enjoyed working on the most? See, whenever I working the, at, at that time, that was uh, I liking. But after some time, I think that no subject is saturating. So I changed my focus. So uh, you visited more than 45 countries as an invited Yes, I have 45 yeah. countries. Yeah. Yes, yes. So yeah. how was your experience? All countries have their unique characteristics. So England is a good place for uh, studying. I mean, a good place for your building career, for doing relaxing job, you go to Australia. And if you have to die in peace, you go to New Zealand. That's my very peaceful. But, but Algeria is quite different. So freedom, so friendly, so hospital. Oh, my goodness. I got many, many things from my, my, my country, which I didn't expect from my institute. This is an statistical institute. I'm not a statistician. My wife is a statistician. I'm the first distinguished scientist outside statistics mathematics. I'm the first director of Indian Statistical Institute. I'm the first president also of Indian Statistical Institute, who is, was a previous director and also an employee. So, uh, moving on, your achievements are mind blowing. So, is there something that you really wanted but didn't end up getting? I haven't thought yet. Well, what I got. It was not in my list of priority to achieve. So it's not that I will want. I don't know what we'll get tomorrow or etc. But I have not had many good students who are now internationally recognized. That's my satisfaction. I've not had a very good amount of students. Students who have now reached international standard. That's, I think, my main contribution. I, I consider that. And many people say, it is not only that you have grown up, you have also taken your group with you. I mean, yes, that's my pleasure. While surfing through your profile, I got to know about machine learning, data mining, and bioinformatics. So, do you have any piece of advice for the students who are going in that field? Yes, yes. Sir. That's what I told yesterday. Say, these subjects are growing up, and every five to ten years, new topic will come. That's why my experience, eh? because of the need of the era, need of the data, need of the technology, etc. So when you, for the young uh, minds, I would say, before selecting, you should be very careful. Whether you are rich in mathematics, analytic liability, or you are rich in, or your interest goes through as application or not. Then accordingly you choose and choose and start learning from the beginning, there are source not jump into the subject. Then if you jump into the subject without knowing the background of the source where from the subject has originated, because subject cannot come from the sky overnight, right? It must have some different other origin before. Ah, you learn, then and only, there you go. And provided if you like this, as because everybody is going, as be, because your parents are doing, as because there is a job market, no. If you want to do science, you have to be very careful about science. You have to be dedicated. There is no shortcut. If you use a shortcut, you will get only short-term gain. No cheating, no plagiarism, no leg pulling. 
work hard and no shortcut dedication go depth in get in depth in depth then you see that lots of problems are generated you do not have to follow others then others will follow you what's on a checklist now it's a just continuous process it's not that i do it and finish my my job is done switch is off on it's a continuous so i have many problems what i wrote the proposal 3 years back for national science year i i am publishing good journal papers this is another subject how can i say it's stop thank you so we are done thank you very much it's my good nice experience to be with you for the last two days